Alter Gracia Gonzalez charges that her daughter, Atasha Gonzalez, is truant from school and disappears for days at a time. Atasha says her mother is just jealous because she'd rather be at Brenda's house than at her mother's. She says Brenda treats her better than her mother does, and if Brenda doesn't make her go to school, she shouldn't have to go. I understand that after reviewing the complaint that you are here today because of the behavior of your daughter. Yes. That apparently she's not going to school, that she is out of control, she doesn't keep curfew, and that you're also particularly concerned that she has been living basically at Ms. Newkirk's house. Is that correct? Yes. Tell me what's happening. Well, um, basically she don't go to school, okay? I have a problem with her. And so she you're seeking the court's help in ordering her back to school? In order for her to go back to school, in order for her to come back home. Then this lady, she keeps her over there in her house. Then she comes over here, and she hangs out with her. I don't know her by her name, I know her by Bobo. That's what they all call her is Bobo. All right, Tasha, what's happening? Well, Are you going to school? Yeah, I, I do go to school, but sometimes I ain't gonna go to school with, in the winter time with pajama pants. All the time I be cold, I ain't gonna, that's the only thing I had. She ain't buy me no clothes for school. I had to buy my own stuff. So you're saying that you're being abused by your brothers at home? Yeah, and, and that you don't have clothes? No. And that's why you can't stay at home? Yeah. All right, are you staying at Miss Newkirk's house? Yes. And who is Miss Newkirk? Miss Newkirk is my best friend's mother. There's, there's really no room for no one to live. Will we just all make do because we love one another, like we love Tasha, so and we don't want to cause problems, and we don't want to have nobody bad. It's not a lot of space. That's how come we're moving out of there. We live in a temporary housing facilities. No one stays there for good. They just house you there until they can find room for your family composition. We will be leaving on the 1st of August. But you've been there now for two years. We've been there correct? for two years, yes. Let me, let me understand the background of Fine. this. Fine. How long has this been going on? Just this, for this school year? This yeah. for half the school year, for yes. For a whole year, For Honor. six months? 12 months? A whole this has year, been Your going Honor. on basically just for a couple of months. They have been friends for over a year, yes. Stop lying. Tell me more about what's happening with your daughter. My problem is they hang out together. They cut school. Okay, together. They they, do you have evidence that your daughter is truant? That she's not going to school? Yes, I do. All right, let me see those reports, please. And what did the court they say? They came, they, I seen the, um, the parole officer over there. They spoke to her. She was seeing a social worker at the courthouse, okay? Um, after that, um, it finished. Then she told me that I had to take my daughter to, um, to seek counseling. Did you I do went, that? Yes, I did. Are you saying that all of these dates, I mean, no, we're talking. I, no, ma'am, I'm not. Of school, miss. I am not saying all these days. You are saying all these days. I'm saying on some occasion. All right, just Let's be honest here. I have taken her to the to see the psychiatrist, to see the um the social workers. They have made up an agreement for her to go to school. I am looking at the report of the number of days that you've been absent this school year, along with the number of days that you're late. How can you explain? I mean, we're talking about weeks of you missing school this year. How can you explain that? Yeah, how am I supposed to go to school with no clothes? Is that the only reason you aren't going to school? No, I got, sometimes I had got beat from her. I wasn't gonna go to school feeling all depressed because all, all the things she say about me. But she's my daughter's best friend. And basically, I like this woman. I just do not like her parenting skills. What is happening that you don't feel like you can be at home? What? Every time I go home, they always got something to argue about. She always get my brothers to hit me, and when they do hit me, she don't say nothing about Stop it. Stop lying, Tasha. I'm not lying. Stop, Stop lying, Tasha. To talk. Let her Stop lying. But her daughter and my daughter, okay, they attend high school. If you are five minutes late and you don't have anything written down with your mom's name on it, they do not let you into the Stop school. Lying. I have called on several occasions and advocated for this woman on her behalf because she was not in home to ask them to admit Tasha in the school, and they wouldn't because I was not blood relation. Okay, That's so let, let's get the facts straight. No, you're lying. Just no, a moment. You're no, you're lying. Just, you lying. Miss Just a Yana. moment. You've got to go back and you've got to build this relationship in your own home with your mother. I expect you to be in school. I am going to direct that you be interviewed by the truancy project that we're going to refer you to so that we can get you back in school, we can get you a tutor, we can get you on track. I'm also directing the caseworker in this matter, and I will make a note in the file and we're going to assign a mentor to her. I do expect you to be in counseling every day. And we're going to review this case so that I am sure that you are following up on this. Now, I do expect you to be responsible yes, and responsive. I am very serious about this.